guys, welcome to this video and today we are playing Afterlife Showcase. This is a showcase guys that I just found because it was on an ad. So by looking at the pictures, you're already going to say, wow, it looks so realistic and it's on Roblox. Yes, I know there's more real, like, there's more kind of games that is realistic, but like this is might be my first ever so realistic get uh, showcase i've never been inside a realistic realistic showcase before because i never even tried but i just found this and maybe think like oh this is gonna be cool might be because it's just gonna show you stuff like that but by reading the description it might be something in this that might be might be interesting so we're gonna read the description it says here you are born in a world that was left abandoned and destroyed corruption plagues the darkest of nights you've only heard stories of the past before all this the past that you wish still existed so it says there find three different documents so we're gonna do that in this video around the map to unfold part of the story with voice acting included sorry but i don't think i'm gonna add that sorry guys this showcase shows the upcoming hardcore horror slash survival game in the future with great visuals as seen here come and relax as you dive into a cinematic experience to an end of the world and there's like if the game's models aren't loading properly please rejoin if you like it please put a thumbs up you can also favorite it and follow it if you want to so yeah guys you're gonna try to find those three different documents and see what the story of the game but i can't put like the voice acting because i'm gonna add the time to the music in the background so I can't do that, but if you guys want to like play this game and hear the voice acting yourself, you can try it out for yourself, link in the description, so if you want to. Now going inside the game, it says here, Earth 24T, status unresponsive. So we're right here and standing right here, there's a big truck here, oh, there's like this, this thing here. What's this? Ooh, I think that's one of the documents. Let's read one of the documents. So here, July 10th, 2035. Document number one, lab results. Doctors and scientists are eager to find the solution. To find more answers, we realize that the veget vegetation are rapidly increasing its growth rate. Massing in numbers, Growing back a forest, trees start to break through the concrete and vines growing from broken down power lines. We have a theory that the spores are causing all this overgrowth. The mutation from the spore uses the humans as host, and therefore turning them hostile as they adopt animalistic behavior. The people who are affected seem to lose their consciousness completely after 4 hours if untreated, however, it is difficult to find a solution. We can't eradicate the spores, but we can slow it down for now. The spores are spreading faster than us, solving this issue. We can't lose hope yet, not now. That was cool. So there's like spores, that's why it's, that's why it's so grassy everywhere so you now got you guys now understand kind of the concept like scientists this is all broken down and abandoned this land is abandoned just because it's just too hairy and full of grass and trees isn't that good for us because there will be no more floods and stuff but let's just look around and see for other more documents. Let's go this way. Because why not? Always go to the left. And let's see if we can find more. Oh, an H, O, and some numbers. I wish there's 
Ooh, I found myself another document with a knife on it. Let's just not get near to the knife and click the document ourselves. It says here August 12, 2035. Document number two. It doesn't have its title though. I remember. Yes, I remember. The day the tower near the west gate had broken in half as it fell into another onto another building. Even though the collapse of that tower happened about a couple days ago, the memory still scares me. The military is doing the best they can to fight off the demons that roam the surface that was ruled by humans. Flames engulfed the streets, smokes polluted the air, the screams of agony plagues our ears. We were told to stay within the boundaries to stay safe. But who knows how long this can last before we all vanish. Wow, that was very, very cool. That was very cool to read. It was very cool for me though. For you guys, it might be boring. So go check the game out. Link in the description. I just said that earlier. But I just really want you guys to test it out if you want to. Because this game looks cool and looks realistic it's like a magic thing inside my eyes my first ever showcase so let's go into the side because i don't want to go straight immediately and look inside these houses oh are these uh, documents it seems unclickable though okay oh we can turn switch on and off okay Ooh, it switches on and off that's cool it's turning off so nobody can able to see me. I have no head anyways. Let's go in here and... What? Another document. So this is gonna be our third document, you guys. Let's just go and click this. It goes here. August 26, 2035. Document number three. There's no title again. They are everywhere. They spread like wildfire. They come in packs. No matter how hard we fought, they just keep on coming. And because of that, we are drastically running low on ammo and supplies. Our movements are being watched with every step. Every night we only lose more and more brave soldiers. We must keep protecting the citizens as much as we can. I hope this will all end soon. I wonder when that will be. Well, only time will tell. Captain D. Slade, Marine Platoon Leader. So the guy who's been like reading, like writing this document is named Captain D. Slade. He's a Marine Platoon leader i'm not getting that but let's hope this this will turn into zombie apocalypse things i did not get it but i thought there's like zombies and stuff that makes human beings go berserk and go crazy like animals that's my guess i'm not 100 percent sure Ooh, there's a shop so yeah guys that's the whole that's the documents i found you guys can try this game for yourself, try to read those and make it look sound like your voice maybe, or just just hear those um, voice acting, because I can't put on the voice acting, I'm very sorry, but you can hear it for yourself. But that was pretty cool, pretty good story to tell, but I'm still not putting on the pieces. I really don't get it, I only get like... The people are like, getting berserk because of those sp spores, but we're the only ones that like, we and the other players in this game are not going berserk or anything. Me thinking that this game might turn into a zombie kind of game where people turn berserk. Maybe it's gonna turn into alone, but a different version of it. We'll never, we'll never know. So yeah, guys. That would be it for this video you can go around for yourself look around but i already found the document so i'm not gonna look around for more because there's nothing to do and ooh, you can click this so yeah guys that's it 
I hope you like this video and if you do like this video smash that like button but if you did not like this video well smash the dislike button it is your choice it is your life so if you want to see more videos like this well you can smash that subscribe button but I would not recommend you to smash that notification bell because you'll never know what kind of videos I'll be uh, posting or stuff like that. It's your decision, not mine. If you want to see more videos like this, put in the notification bell yourself. So yeah, guys, that's it. I hope you're safe in your houses, and please try this game. It sounds cool, and it needs people to look at this. So, yeah, bye.